out one because there were so many things that were happening. Um, I'm particularly interested in group dynamics and the way people work together in groups. So there were lots and lots of things that we were learning together. Um, but the key, key one really was probably not checking up who, what, where the experience was in the group before we started. We were very good about planning and reviewing the first plan when it didn't uh, come to fruition. But not once did we check out if anybody had any experience with working with sheep, for example. And of course it was a real shock at the end when we discovered that we did in fact have one member who'd spent a lot of time in her childhood and teenage time working with sheep. Which members of the group were real team players? The ones who just wanted to get on, um, have some support, understand what they were trying to achieve. And then the other part of it was the leaders, really. Um, there were two or three people who, who came through as natural leaders, but then were quite shy about putting themselves forward or recommending themselves, and so were sort of re recommending others. And there was a lot of debate around, well, should I be the leader or not? Different, because you don't actually know how the sheep are going to behave. Um, it's not about how clever I am or how brave I am. It's actually about putting all those things aside and working together to achieve a very clear task. And I like the references that were made about these are our customers, the sheep do represent the customers. And I think a lot of companies with teams may well find that their team forgets who their customers mm. are and that uh, the customers don't behave in the way that they expect them to behave. Bringing together people who are not team members in, the, in their normal working environment was a big learning curve for everyone because, of course, most of us are in that situation. We don't all belong to nice, neat team, teams. We do bring in new people and change them around. So, uh, yeah, good experience.